client with the next plan mortgage, simply select new client from the main dashboard. Here there are various fields uh, that you are able to complete. The mandatory fields are first name, last name, gender and date of birth. So for my client I'm going to name him John Hughes. He's a male and his date of birth is the 1st of January 1991. I could also input his marital status, preferred name, anticipated retirement age, nationality, country of residence, national insurance number, as well as any contact details for him. I'm also able to change the advisor, so if I was an admin, I could assign it to um, the advisor that I was working for. Be able to select whether I did a vulnerability assessment for this client. In this instance, I've input a first name, a surname, gender, date of birth. I'm going to put his anticipated retirement age in, nationality, country of residence, and put a phone number in for him as well. If I wanted to include a partner, I would simply select yes. And as you can see, the partner comes up here. You would just need to put in the same details for partner. So once we've filled in these details, we would need to go to marketing preferences. So the client can either be contacted via email, uh, via post, phone or SMS. So I'm going to select no for these three and yes via phone, as I've put the, the phone number in there. Going through to consent, so you would just fill this out uh, for GDPR compliance. And once you've done that, all you'd need to do is press save. And as you can see, it takes you straight to the client summary page.